seeing your garment, your creation on the runway and then, you know, to take the last bow on the runway, that's most fulfilling. The most fulfilling thing about being a designer is probably having your mind so active all the time. When you're really into your work, you just keep going and going. You want to know how things are done, you want to know how things are made from A to Z and that is a very good thing to have. Each and every detail in life that inspired me, I think some of the great, great, great designer like uh, Christopher Balenciaga, yeah, I think he's the one who, in, who inspired me most. My inspirations are from anything and everything, basically. Um, I can be inspired by things, uh, people, Mostly the more special and artistic ones, I would say like uh, paintings or uh, buildings. <music> Must do rituals are everything that's on my iPad. Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, the news, style.com and um, jogging. In the morning, I start my day by taking some pictures um, of the sky, the cloud, the nature, the trees, everything that around me. When I wake up, this is my routine. I go and have a drink of water uh, with Redoxin, obviously, because I need to have vitamin C in my body due to the late nights that is required in this industry. Uh, after then, I would just want to be left alone for half an hour minimum to an hour. An hour would be the ideal time and I will just blast my music for that morning. Wake up, look into the mirror and you know, tell myself I'm beautiful and you know, feel good luck the whole day. And I always buff my nails. It's a very good habit. Every single day I'll buff my nails and I'll put a lot of hand cream because it get, gets dry easily. goal towards in 20, 30 years time is to run a, a fashion school that is well credited. I want people to actually come in and know what really goes on behind the scenes. You know, it's not about the glam, it's not about the fame, there's real hard work behind this industry. I would definitely want to be uh, like a major force in the fashion industry next time. And I, I hope to show in one of the fashion capitals of the world, Paris, London, New York. Milan, yeah. I think it would be very great if I can make something that I like to wear and also the people would like to give a try. Maybe one day I'll you know, take over the job from a renowned fashion house. You know, that would be like the... Yeah, the cherry on top. Yeah.